And uh, Sour Shoes is apparently back pranking Steve Langford. <laughs> <laughs> no kidding. <laughs> yeah, in a very frustrating day for Howard 100 News reporter, Sour Shoes or someone sounding just like him called Steve about 100 Ooh. times yesterday. Langford says he would like Sour Shoes to go to jail, Ooh. and Tim Sabian has asked Sour to cease the calls. All right. Very good. And uh, stay tuned to Howard 100 News at noon. Thanks, Shirley. Thanks. Sour shoes. He gives me a headache. Sour shoes. Is your father there? Oh, hello? Sour? Yeah. Is this sour? Father, sour. Sour, I want you to know what you're doing is wrong. It's against the law. <laughs> it's against the law. It's against the law. Uh, sour, I'm calling. <laughs> Is this the actual call? Hello. Sour shoes again. Hello. But I never saw something that big. Hello. Hello? Steve, it's Sour Shoes. Listen, I'm right in the middle of something. Let me call you right back. Hello? Oh, my God. I can't talk right now. Can I call you back? Hello? Langford's got a huge penis. I want it inside my mouth. Oh. Hey, Sour. Big, huge penis. Sour. 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 Hey. Big, huge penis. Hey. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Uh, gee, are your parents there? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, would you want to put them on the phone? Hmm? With your monstrous cock, I'm dripping wet. Can you, can you hear me? Put my mouth around. Can you hear me? Yeah. Uh, put put them on the phone. Oh my God, Steve, I'm real busy. Can I call you right back? Put them on. I was made for love and Steve Langford. Oh. I'm Mike's dad. He told me that you uh, wanted me to uh, call you. And how do I know? Uh, you know my son. I'm sorry. You know my son. I I guess is sour shoes. I see. My name is Frank. I see. Well, how do, yes, Frank. How do I know you're Frank? Uh, he told me uh, to call you. He said you wanted to speak to me. Right. Well, if you are uh, his father, <laughs> um, well, I, I don't really know whether you are or not. But if you are, um, you know he's. <laughs> Do you know the, about the phone calls he makes? Uh, you, I have some idea. Uh, you know, I hear some voices coming out of the bedroom, but... Uh, uh, in the past uh, couple of weeks, about 300 phone calls to me? He, you know, he, he calls everybody, Mr. Langford. No, no, no. You know, no. Uh, if you are, Frank, and if you are his father, uh, uh, 300 phone calls. Come on, that cannot be... A Come on. Well, I don't know whether you're his father or not, but if you are, uh, these phone calls uh, are harassment, and they're against the law. Okay, the law. how would you like me to resolve this? Well, get control of the situation. It's against the law. Oh, well, you know, he, he he's... He's well, a what? He's a creative. He's a creative. Well, no, you're not well, listening. What? Well, listen, maybe you're not Frank. Don't waste my time. No more phone calls. <laughs> what if he's not Frank? <laughs> if you can hear me, can you hear me, Sour? Sour shoes, can you hear me? Can you hear me? Hey, can you hear me? Well, listen, I just want you to know that I want you to go to jail for this. And I will be happy to work on that. Because you're insistent on committing this crime over and over and over again. I want you to go to jail. What's the Got crime? It? His cock measures 17. Interrupting him from finding out where the whack packers are. There it is. It's against the law. Crime. It's against the law. <laughs> <laughs> 
Frank. <laughs> no, no. 